Villa, what's been good? Nah, man. They are blood. They are same old thing. Same old thing. I hear they're it. They're what hear you it. say? Same old as well, bro. I'm just looking for throws for the sofa. <laughs> That's where my life is now. People that knew me, the old people that knew me before, that know, that would probably thinking, what, man? What's what has happened to man? But yeah, this is life. The, the throws for the sofa. Yeah, man. Got these new sofas coming, right? I don't want these youths. These youths ain't. They're not even allowed on it, blood. I don't even. They just <laughs> look at it and sit on the floor, blood. Cause they mashed up the last one. And like, yeah. No, nah, man said they're not allowed on it. Just got to look at it and admire it. I'm going to turn into like, you know, like the old, old Caribbean grandparents where they had the, the room where you couldn't go in with the plastic. Oh, yeah, I love it. Love it. Love <laughs> it. The whole room is for show. Dude. You know what it was? The showroom. The show yeah, room. for nothing. There's no one coming to see it. Who are you showing this room to? My grand used to do that. Yeah, She don't do it now, which is, but she used to do that, right? And... You weren't allowed in there, bro. She, the only time she'd let, like, because she had, they had, like, her and my granddad, they had this, like, this little, um, they had, like, a bar in there. That was, I wouldn't say it was a proper bar, like, like a bar. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So when they're, like, when they're, when they're, like, maybe, you might see it, you might glimpse it at, like, Christmas or something, <laughs> the room, you get me? But that was for, like, if they're, they're people's, then they would take their peoples in there and drink, but no youths weren't allowed in that room, man. man. Nah, nah, my grandparents weren't that bad still. You know, although, although they had like this flipping cabinet full up of china. And, and oh, they all got that, yeah, yeah. They're not, they don't get, and, they don't get used, they don't get but, used. This is what I'm saying. It's Never despair. once have I ever seen none of them things they used, yeah. I think that was. I think that was a thing that they just did, man. That was just a thing that that was a thing that my mum, my mum's kind of took taken that on as well. Not as bad as my grandparents, but my mum's got. You might even have seen it, but my mum's got cabinets in the living room with things in there. Changes. It's not it's just, just there. It's just there. Yeah, yeah. Some of it is like she says, like expensive. I'm like, you might as well sell that then. What's the, what's it? What will it or give it to me? I don't know. We, why is it? You know if, if if they were genuinely collectibles, then yeah. cool. I can see why. I can see why everyone's collecting all this brick up rack here. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. If not though, why are you collecting all this brick up rack? I don't understand. <laughs> I have no clue, but I wish I could answer this question. I have no idea. I don't understand. My mum, to be fair, my mum's like a hoarder, bro. Like she, t she has bare like shoes. You go in the cupboard, yeah. Do you know what the 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 because I got bare trainers as well, yeah. And I'm not, um, bro. I'm not good at getting rid of things. And my mum's like that, right? And I know I've got bare trainers, yeah. And I know I'm not wearing all these trainers. Even now, I've got some. <laughs> so I don't know why I'm. I'm keeping them. It's like a weird, and I've, I've obviously got this from my mum because my dad's not like that. I'm, I'm got bare trainers, yeah, but no, but trainers I can understand though. Now, nah, but I'm... you can understand if you're wearing them though. I'm, I'm saying I'm not. I'm saying that I'm, I've got. I'm probably not even gonna wear some of them, bro. I'm probably not even gonna. It's foolishness. Yeah, no, that's what I'm not. Them. If I'm not gonna wear them, I might as well get rid of them. But part of my soul won't let me, <laughs> won't let, me let it go. It's like some weird. It's weird, bro. I can't even explain it to you, bro. Man just can't let go of, of certain things. It's weird. Man, I so got rid of, of my soul. Do you know what happens to me as well, yeah? What happens to me, yeah, is I get... This is probably part of it as well, yeah? I have had clothes, and I'm like, I don't even wear this, yeah? Right? Or a clothes... You, you've done this as well. And do you know what? Everyone from my era has done this, right? And you got rid of it in like 2002, yeah? And now <laughs> man's wearing them now, blood! Now, and now, now, what you paid for that then, yeah, if you used to buy that back now, like, remember all them, blood, all them Avrix jackets and the mold uh, jackets and all them yes. things? Yeah? Yeah. yeah? That's back now. But you know how much they cost now, blood, compared to when uh, you were them? 
Everett's jackets are ridiculous. Everett's jackets is a piss take. It was a piss take when we was youths, yeah, but not like this. Yeah, but listen, you know, like I wish I held on to the AVs from then. This is what, now, man, will be giggling. This is what I'm saying, and I got rid of all of that. I got rid of yeah, all of that yeah. stuff because I'm like, I ain't wearing I this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So part of me in my soul, like, <laughs> uh, because later on now, yeah, do you get me? But. You know what? Nah, you just got nah. to The joke thing is, yeah, you're doing that with stuff that ain't coming back in, bro. It's not coming back like April. Well, what's going to happen is, is that out of the whole uh, 100 things that I do keep, maybe like two of them might come back. That's the, <laughs> do you know what I mean? So, so it's a waste of time either way. Do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> I say it, guy, anyway. <laughs> What's going on, like, blood? Who's winning the league, man? Take wait, 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 wait. Before you answer the question, don't answer as an Arsenal fan. I want you. I know it's hard because, because yeah, because you listen. It's open. It's open. I'm not gonna lie, but seriously, yeah, it's you, Man City, and it's Liverpool. That's a hundred percent. No one ain't getting in that. Yeah, it's you, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who, at the end, who is gonna lift this trophy? This is that I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I cannot. I'm, I still say it's Man City, but I read out the way because you man are just slapping up teams like they're idiots. <laughs> some stupid. What you're breaking records? Six five nil like it's nothing. So who? But it's, but, but we've seen Arsenal play amazing football, and we know Arsenal can do this and still not win nothing. So I need to know what, honestly, honestly, in I know you you, you want to say Arsenal, yeah, and you might still say Arsenal, but who do you really believe is going to withhold the trophy at the end? So you know what, yeah, City City have done it before, innit? it? Yeah, they've been there and done this before. Yeah, Liverpool have been the only other team in the pe- era that's that. Like, Push them, yeah, yeah, stop them, uh, yeah, and and even stop them, and they've only managed to do that for a little one. bit, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Obviously, us man last season, even though I never thought that we was gonna win it, we was at the top for two. Like, I don't wanna be out here got got the record for being at the top for the longest amount of days and then don't, don't win it. That's you've done not, that now, yeah, you've done yeah, it. That's yeah. not. I don't want that, but cool. With that being said, yeah, there is some very interesting games still, Bro, still yes. played. With all of you, man. So, yeah, this is what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. So have you played I, I, have you played both City and Liverpool twice already? So we played Liverpool twice already. Yeah. Um we drew with them at Anfield. And we beat and them. Beat them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then City, we beat them at the Emirates. We're going to the Etihad the end of this month still. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I say the end of this month. So we basically got Brentford today. Both of you have to win that game. Both of you. Well, this is the thing though, yeah. So City are obviously playing Liverpool on Sunday. Yeah. yeah. That's at Anfield. The ideal scenario for me as an Arsenal fan yeah. is for them to draw that game yeah. and then for us to <clears throat> for us to beat C. If that happens... Yeah, because it's long. Either You don't want none of them to win. Of course. Yeah, yeah, nah, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, nah, course. Nah, nah. yeah, 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 of course. Because... Oh, oh, of course, really. the best outcome. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Or worst case scenario, City win, and then we beat City. Yeah. Because we're only a point behind City, whereas we're two points behind Liverpool. Yeah. With that said... If City beat Liverpool and beat you, have they won the league? So, I don't think, I don't think Man City is going to beat both of you. I don't think they're going to beat both of you. I don't think I don't think Man City is going to beat both of you. There's been a lot of football to be played. 
but if if they were to do that, it it looks like it would be more likely that they would win it. Yeah. But but I don't think a I don't think that's gonna happen. No, I can't. I don't think so. And to answer the question, I I don't know. You know, I don't know. Like it's it's I, I reckon it's gonna go down to the wire. That like you know that. No, no. Nah, it, 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 look at the. Game. What's the point? Were you like one point behind each other or some something stupid like that? There's two points between us and Liverpool and a point between us and City. Mad. And the, and the, the thing that makes it's I, this has never happened before, three teams like that. No, I don't think it has. No, it hasn't. Not this no, close. No, never. It's never. It's never. It's never happened. Not even not even kind of close. Not like that. No, no, not three teams where it could be no. any three of these teams. No. And 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 not for this long either. Like we're coming, we're in, going into we're coming to we're mid March now. When does the league, when does the league end? It's coming. It's business. It's business yeah, yeah, end now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we're coming into the last last ten game weeks, bro. The last ten game weeks soon. Like this is game. Well, this is yeah, yeah. I'm sure this is the last the last ten game weeks. Yeah, it's coming up. But D, you didn't answer my question, though, fam. I, I don't know. I don't know. League? I don't Who know. I don't do know. you feel like that it's gonna win? I, like, obviously, as an Arsenal fan, I gotta say Arsenal, innit? Oh, but I, I genuinely don't know. Like, I, I like the fact that we're able to just quietly go about our business. No, I ain't really talking about whether we're gonna win it or not. One thing I've noticed about Arsenal fans, yeah, is the energy is not the same. You know, they ain't talking like you've won it, like last season. No, I think, no, no, I no, think no. the experience of last season is like, you know what? I think not an ain't won till it's won. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I've noticed that. There's not, I ain't seen no madness yeah, this, not this season. Not Even last season, it never made no sense to me, yeah? Because we had to beat Liverpool in order for the points difference to be big enough between us and C. I think the excitement with you guys last season, yeah. I'll give that you... That was a foolishness. Yeah, I'm but even... I'll give... I'll give you what, but even though I take the, the piss or whatever and red tete, I'll give... What I, <coughs> you might not have been that in that position for a while. Nah. So, and you wasn't even supposed to be with there, bro. You weren't even supposed to be. So I think the shock is like, what? And then you're thinking like yeah, you're thinking yeah, yeah. about Leicester now. You're thinking what now? We could actually win this, yeah. But obviously, what let you down was was the, um ex- I think it was the players were young, experienced, and Arteta's new, and you just weren't ready to oh, be in that situation. It was Shaka. I'm no, it was Shaka, blood. I don't know why he kick up Trent, blood, at Anfield, blood. There was no need. We oh, was yeah, two yeah, nil up, yeah, oh, yeah, man. Yeah. Kick up <laughs> Trent, blood, and then they they. <laughs> Flipping, all decided they was gonna come to life. Flipping, I remember that game. We, we was lucky to basically end two two. Then we flipping lost to West Ham after that, and then after that, blood the wheels just came off the whole train, fam. Mm. Yeah. Vex. I mean, not the whole thing is Jacques' fault, but but a lot, <laughs> a lot of it was Jacques' fault. Chat, what, what answer are you giving me though? You go give me an answer. I'm I'm gonna go with Arsenal still. Arsenal. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna go with Arsenal. I still I I just got uh, this weird feeling, and I don't want it to happen yet. I just got some weird feeling that Man City is gonna do the treble again, blood. I do not know why, but I just got this, and I do not want this to happen. But I got a feeling they're gonna do the treble again. I'm not sure. I'll wait and see how Partey comes back into the squad. Yeah, and how good. and how he gets on. Well, he's he's that he's fit now, but obviously we'll need to manage man and everything there. Getting back into the yeah, he's missed bear the season. Like I don't know, I'll see I'll see how man integrates because I'm not gonna lie, I got frustrated man being injured for so long and being out of the squad for so long, but now we don't miss him, so it's one of them ones where I'm like, okay, well, man would actually be. Adequate uh, cover and, and squad flipping and adequate squad player. So mm, let me see how that pans out. Otherwise, yeah. cashing on him in the summer 
and then we're gonna obviously have to replace him, isn't it? I feel like that's what, I feel like that's what we should do with Mount. I forgot he even played for Man United until I, saw the <laughs> until I saw the picture the other day. I was like, oh, yes. oh yeah, he played for us, man, and you got number seven. That's, how come? That's when you know that it's bad at United when man forgets that a player plays and it's the number seven that we're forgetting. Nah, Mason Mount has he that his career is just gone off a cliff or did something. Chelsea, did Chelsea know what they were doing when they were selling him? You have to ask that because he's been injured like most of the time we've had him. He played about, I'm going to say about three, four games, uh, and, he, and and done nothing. But in his defence, he's not really had time. To, he's not he's not really had enough game time to to really. Do anything. Do anything, yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. also, you might have been shit as well. <laughs> and we've been that. And we've been so, that too. Did you watch I, the Rashford thing? Have you seen it? Nah, nah, nah. I see, I see, I see, um, I see reports on Star Sports still. What do, you, what do you think about what he's saying? I mean... Do you think he should have said anything? I think it would have been better if he hadn't have said anything and then obviously scored yeah, I agree. In, in the in the derby, innit? Yeah. Because that agree. goal was a bangers. That yeah. goal would have done all the talking. That he just scored just now as well against Everton, I think. Yeah, he, yeah. He but Everton. that was a penalty, man. I haven't even seen it, but I know I know he it scored. Penalty. You man scored two penalties and beat them 2-0. Oh, both penalties? Yeah. Oh, I didn't even know that. Listen, yeah. Yeah, we'll take that, though. We'll take that. <laughs> we'll take that. Did you watch the fight? Man, thump up my man. Listen. I didn't hey. watch it. I didn't watch it. I fell asleep. I didn't, I don't, but but <laughs> I fell asleep. Not gonna lie. But I've seen <laughs> I've seen the footage. And nah, AJ folded my like yeah, yeah. Do you know what? That. I said, remember I said to you yesterday, I said I'd I've got a feeling AJ is going to win. I don't know why, but I feel like AJ is going to win, yeah? But when I see the footage, I'm like, whoa, I didn't know. When I said he was going to win, I didn't think he was going to tough my man out. Because my man's not... Yo. Yeah, he's yeah, not no joke, brother. That's and what he, was, he was dealing with Fury, which makes me think now, I want to see Fury and Joshua now. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me. Like people that saying, and 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 I was one of them people. Yeah, do you know what? Do you know what? He, he probably don't watch, but if he if he, if he somehow comes across this pod, Anthony Joshua, I am actually sorry because right, <laughs> I believed in your thing. I supported that. I never stopped supporting you, but I believed in your thing. Yeah, and then you got you got tumped up by that fat Mexican brother. <laughs> and then it was looking all mad, and I thought I didn't. I was going, something was going on. Was something was going on with him? Do you get what I'm saying? Obviously, yeah. And then, and then I saw him. I saw a man fight him again on the rebound. What was that guy's name? The Mexican brand, and, Andy Ruiz. Right on the rebound, and when he fought him on the rebound, that was in um, Dubai or something. That was proper boxing. Proper boxing, yeah. So I know I right, Anthony Joshua is Anthony Joshua is a boxer, he can box. But when I'm looking at Fury and what he's dealing with, and I got tumped up by Wilder, get up like Undertaker and do all these kind of things, yeah. I'm thinking, I don't know if uh, Joshua's top tier, yeah, top tier, yeah. But I don't know if he can deal with Fury. But then I watch Fury fight my man, yeah. And is his name Anganu? Anganu, Anganu yeah. yeah. I see yeah, yeah. fighting guy and struggle and struggle again, like you struggle. Yeah. And he lost that fight for me, man. He lost he that. Lost fight. that. No, nah, he did. He did. And you know what? Everyone knows that. People can say what they want. Everyone that watched that fight knows that he lost that, right? But for boxing, they can't let yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they can't nah, let that. Man can't right? hand over the titles to Emma. No way. Way. What? That's All a right. that's a just taking a mick, right? But then when you watch Joshua now fight my man, who gave Fury a hard time, and I, I'm not listen. Did you you watch the whole fight? So you tell me. I haven't watched. I haven't watched the whole fight. I've just seen. You said the whole fight. It was two rounds, brother. <laughs> was it two man, rounds? Man dropped AJ dropped flipping in Garnu three times. 
in two rounds, Dan. I thought it was three rounds at first, yeah. Because oh dropped... my day! Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? I didn't even ask what round it was. It was three rounds. No, no it was two rounds, blood. He dropped and him. What? So Mendes is on him from the beginning. I mean, I you don't think I need to watch so. it now. I need to so, watch it. So, I I dropped sleep for the the Joseph Parker and um the big Chinese brother. Yeah, Parker, yeah. I dropped... Parker won that as well, didn't it? Yeah, 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 he got he he got dropped twice and then come back to win that or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever fight, yeah. But I dropped sleep during that, yeah. So mm-hmm. I woke up when AJ knocked him that knocked down and got the first time. That's when I woke up because I woke up and heard the the, the noise warning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then now that's when man tuned into the team, yeah. <clears throat> so he must have hit. He must have. In the beginning of round two, I think he's knocked him down again, yeah? Yeah. Because apparently in, in round one, Ngani wasn't doing too bad up until the point he got knocked down, innit? He got hurt. Yeah, yeah, that shook that man. That man just licked him down to the floor, yeah? Licked him down again in the second. I'm guessing early on in the second, because like in the last minute or whatever, that's when man... Folded man up like oh god me <laughs> yo brother nah nah that top was spiteful then we said about Tyson though man's coming man's coming back to fight my man uh brother listen yeah. the, you know, why is he doing that that's what I'm thinking it's got it can only be for it can only be don't get me wrong I wouldn't fight Tyson even now I'm not going to lie. No. Do you understand what I'm saying? No. No matter what, Have how you old are you? Have videos? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Brother, yeah. His, his trainer don't even look like he want to be in there, blood. His trainer looking like this every minute, blood. <laughs> the, the, the only thing is, though, as you get older, no matter who you are, yeah, the... the um, I was trying to think of the word, but I'm gonna use I'm gonna use the viciousness in you to come smaller as you get older. Like the energy you had, like if you was in a fight, look, listen, you can fight at any age. What I'm saying is the 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 thought process of you fighting when you was 19 compared to you now is gonna be yeah, 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 yeah. You might be more. In, you might be think. You might think more now, but sometimes thinking more is just that's what will get you tamp up. Really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Too much. Do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> but at the same time, lad, have you listen? Mike, Ta- you see the brother on the pads for Mike Tyson yeah, in yeah, this yeah, video. Yeah. Look like Man him. looks shook. You know the damn ones. He's getting paid, but he looks shook. Yeah, shook off, fam. He's on the pad like this. <laughs> He looks like he's still hurting him, even though he's got pads. He's still like he's, he's holding the full, full licks. You know what I mean? Full power in the licks, man. I want to see the video. I want to see the brother. The brother always looks always look shook off like he's about to lose his head. I'm not surprised though. Mike Tyson still looks like he will not be. Listen, is Logan he gonna win Paul. this fight? Is it a pro? I need to know the rules. Can because sh- surely it's not. Is this a fight? Because yeah, it's 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 boxing, fam. It's boxing still. It's boxing. What's my man's name? What's his name? I can't remember, I, I, I can't remember whether it's Jake Paul or Logan. Paul. Paul. One of them. One of them. It's Jake. Yeah, it's Jake Paul. Yeah, it's Jake Paul. Yeah. Jake Paul. What has he got a chance against Tyson? <sighs> Nah, I don't think so. And if blood, like, I don't think, think okay, he has. If, if I, don't, Paul... I don't think his chin stands up to that. Just ho- try, try. I, I dare you to try hold one of them tops. <laughs> you know, I dare you. I dare you. Man's out here talking about all this money and rare tear, rare tear. I want to see if your money can stand up. If your money can support your jaw. After Tyson <laughs> lifts that off, that's what I want to see. Yeah, can your money support your jaw after man licks that off? That's what I want to see. Tyson has more to lose in this. Tyson ain't got nothing to lose. I think Tyson's, he 
Tyson, he, he can't, he, he can't take nothing away from Tyson, yeah, but he's still Tyson. Tyson can't lose this, and, uh, and it doesn't matter if he's fifty. How old's Tyson? Fifty something. I think he's sixty something now, but yeah, so, um, so, no, I'm like, can't, He can't be sixty something. No, nah, no. Nah. He can't, he can't be. That's right, I say 60 something. No, nah, we gotta look. That is wild. <laughs> Man's an old man, blood. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't think, I don't nah, think. He's 57, he's 57. All right, all right. All right, so we, neither of us was really wrong there. No, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah, yeah, yeah, it's basically 60. But Red up. He can't, he can't, um, but he'll knock he you can't out. let Jake Paul win that. He's gonna not listen. Met Jake Paul, met one mistake. You know, just leave your jaw in the air for too long, that one second too long, and you're gonna get fold up like origami, just like Ngannou did at the weekend, bro. He's, he's very more peaceful now. If you watch his, you watch his podcast. It's no, not, no, no, no. He's just buns and that. He buns bare as well. So he is the stop- Listen, he's Tyson, brother. Like, he <laughs> buns it down. He buns it down. On his podcast, it's all about smoke. It's bunning, blood, yeah? Him and some other guys. So he's going to have to do a lot of training. He's older, yeah? And he's very um, peaceful now. He's on, He's on like, the spiritual... He the, was... The, the, this man was... Whereas before, whereas before, man, whereas before, fucking, man I'm talking not, about eating man's man. children and... I wish I could stand on their testicles so they could feel my pain and blood. That is my. <laughs> Do you remember when he said that? That's like, who says that, bro? Do you know what I'm saying? He said, yeah, Mike that's what he Tyson. said. Mike Tyson I want to step on know. man's children's testicles so they can, so that's how you will know my pain. He wants to step on a, on a child's testicles, on a man's child's testicles. So he, that's, that's the, you don't want to fight nobody like that. Do you think Jake Paul is going to get knockout? Yes, I do. He's no, going to get knockout. He is. But do you think he has taken this fight because he's not our age? Yeah, because I'm thinking anyone our age is not stupid enough to do this. So I'm thinking, because he's not from this era. Because I would, I know Jake, well, I know we're older than Jake Paul. If he grew up, if he grew up like we did, because we grew up with Mike. Yeah. I'm not fighting Mike under no circumstances. Like, no, there's no amount of peas. Let me see the story about the locks. <laughs> yeah. When they was like, man was moving funny towards Eve and they had, they was all like, someone has to stab man and yeah. no one wants to do it. And they're like all contemplating like how they, this is free man. They're all big brothers as well, you know. Mike Tyson is not a big guy. He's small. That just shows you the fear, blood. This is free big man. It's like, nah. We can't protect the gal, yeah, but how yeah, we can but, do this? Yeah, the, yeah, <laughs> right. No, what? We're not fighting. We're not going. Yeah, he's we're, 20, we're, he's, we are not he's, swinging with this, brother. He's are 27 you years old, but he don't know about Mike Tyson. He's 27. He don't know about Mike Tyson. He don't. He's, all, he's also 27, so his bones will heal. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> no, that benefits him though, no? Yeah, I mean it definitely it, it, it will do when after you mash down your jaw side, man. It definitely because, will do. All right, because Tyson is quick, but can Tyson take a bang at his age now? We don't know this. Because no one he's ain't bagging. Mike. No one ain't bagging Mike Tyson. Mike. Tyson, blood. He's Mike Tyson. <laughs> but listen. So yeah, so listen, so today's Theme, mixed relationships. I'm trying to get my cancelled. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, but, you know what I mean? It's just opinions, isn't it? Everyone's, everyone's um, allowed to say what they're saying. Would you and have you dated out of your race? I have dated out my race. Yeah. Would I do it now? Yeah. No, I'm I'm less inclined to do it now. I'm not gonna lie to you. So you say just strictly, strictly you only be with black girls. That's it. That's my preference. Yes. Yeah. yeah definitely. That's my okay, preference. Okay. So you're not ruling out. Okay. Would you would you marry someone that isn't black? <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> man, no spot, man. Straight on the spot, man. Yeah, yeah. Man. Just, straight, just go straight in. in. Nah, nah. I'm Wouldn't. Gonna, nah. Nah. Why, 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 why though? What is it? What, why? From my observations and my experience, it doesn't work. Yeah. Okay. So in my experience, I'm having to do too much translation of half the things man's saying, which already <laughs> that's wrong. I don't have to translate what I'm fucking saying. None of them was that. I just want to be able to talk the talk, talk them, talk my things, and you'd be you be you to be able to get this. I don't want to then have to translate it like later on down the line. What, what, do, you, what, what do you mean though? Like, not, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. There's not a wrong or right answer. This is what you had. This is what this is. Do you know what I mean? But what I'm saying is, what, what do you mean though that they would when you say, um, what did you say? When you say, you basically said they don't. You want you want you. You don't have to explain after dinner. You want them to just understand. That's basically what yeah, you said. I don't have to translate certain things. What, yeah. what do you what 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 would you what would you have to translate that they might not understand? Give me an example. And who is there? Are we talking about specific race of people or people that are just not black? <laughs> so, first is a specific race of people. It was white chicks. I'm, I'm, I'm not even. So, so, white chicks ain't got no hope with you. Is that what you're saying? I'm not saying they ain't got no hope. First they ain't got no hope. Think, okay, okay, okay. I, I don't think they like, man. That, that's first of all. They ain't first. got no hope of marrying you. Anything else can go up. <laughs> <laughs> nah, because when you say it like that, no, it makes you sound like, yo. <laughs> no, but it's preference. It's preference, though, isn't it? Listen, there's girls out here, there's girls out here, right, that would sleep with black guys and, be, and do things with a black guy, yeah, but they wouldn't marry them. That's just facts. Listen, and there's nothing wrong with that. It's preference. So before it, I don't want no comments coming talking to us about no. it because this is all. You get in the comments. You get in yeah. the comments. Get no, you there. can, yeah. but this is people's yeah. preference. Everyone, I think, I think you should be allowed to. <laughs> if you, it's up to you who you want to be with and who you don't want to be with, and that's your choice. You know what I'm saying? So when I'm asking you this, this is how you feel in it. It's not no anyone that gets offended. That's their business. I'm. Just, this is how you feel in it. So. <laughs> Man's not saying we're not we're not saying we hate other races. This is preference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so man. basically, what you're saying is you ain't marrying white girls, but you do things with them. <laughs> <laughs> but 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 you're saying but girls that ain't white, yeah, have kind of a chance, but not a chance like the black girl did. That's what you're saying. Oh, nah, that's the. Not... <laughs> I just put that in highlight form. <laughs> That is not what I'm saying at all. Oh, yes. Wally. <laughs> Man just chose what I'm saying. My preference is <laughs> to marry a black woman. A black woman. That's my preference. Yeah. But. There's no but. That no, just definitely a black... oh, so you wouldn't do nothing with white girls? I mean, I've already done. <laughs> yeah, all right. But well, what about now? If opportunity arise, arose, you would. Don't, why are you thinking about this? This is not. Come on, man. I'm just saying. There's nothing wrong with that. You just ain't marrying a girl. That's you just wouldn't oh. marry a girl, a girl that's white because of um, culture barriers and these things. I mean, ultimately, you know, like... There's some the white girls out here. I'm not trying to convince you. I'm just playing devil guys, but there's some white girls out here that that know Wagwan, though. I mean, I hear that. I hear that. But also, like, at one point in history, they would have sold, man, fam. None of them are. <laughs> that, that seems wild to me. I'm not going to lie to you. Yeah, but that's that like their great, totally great, 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 great granddad or something, man. That's not I mean, I hear that, but... What are you saying? Relations? Yeah. Guilt by association. Guilt by association, yeah. <laughs> your, your kids are obviously black, because you're saying that's what, so your kids are black. And then your kid comes home with a white girl. How would you feel about that? It depends on why they got into the relationship with my child. So if they got into the relationship with my child because they genuinely love my child, 
Yeah. Then cool. Do your thing. But what, would be the, what would be the other reason though? It could only be because they like each other at first. I mean, it could be a fetish for all I know. You know, none of them ones. And then this is uh, 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 now. You know, none of them ones. Like, they, oh, like, like black guys. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. yeah, well, so, if he knows that, then. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? He might be like you. I mean, wanna, is that he thing. might be like you and just wanna just wanna do a thing, but <laughs> they're trying to marry her though. Hey, <laughs> man, man, trying to get me duffy out here in these streets, man. I never said that. <laughs> do you know what? What are you like, saying? Yeah, me? yeah. What I'm gonna answer. I'm gonna answer. Well, obviously, well, I've got obviously you know me. I've got five. I've got five kids. One of them is black. Fully, Jalil, oldest one, big up you. And then um obviously my other my other four are, are mixed, the half Indian, half black, which we know. I'm just, you know this, but I'm just so the people know. Do you get what I'm saying? Um I ne- listen, growing up, I never saw I <clears throat> I never um really thought about it. And I think with me, I think I think part of it yet yeah, is to do with um a lot of, I feel like a lot of who you end up with is how your parents are, what you've been installed in you, and where you come from, where you, where your area, right? So I've kind of had a b- 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 half and half, right? So you've got like my dad side, and my dad, they're, like they're from Halsden, yeah, from Stonebridge, from Halsden, yeah. So I spent a lot of my childhood in Halsden. Which is just black people, yeah. It's just black people, just just black people, yeah. Few few other races, but just black people, yeah. But then you've got my mum, who's from Hammersmith, right? And then we moved to Hayes, yeah. And we, when we was in Hayes, we, as you would know, it's not like the Hayes now. Do you understand what I'm saying? So it was predominantly white. So when I was going to school, I was around predominantly white people when I was going to school. So I was predominantly around white people at school. But then, like in holidays and stuff, I'm in Halsden, right? So I'm hearing all the Malcolm X and all of that. I'm hearing all of that. The Nation of Islam. I'm seeing all of that stuff. I'm hearing all of that. But I'm also around white people too and other races as well, right? So my, I don't even want like I. Trying to bait out my dad, but my my dad, okay, my dad would prefer me to or his children to be with someone black. He's never hidden this. He's always said this, right? Whereas my mum, she doesn't mind as long as you're happy. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. So I've grown up because I've I've had both of that. I've I've kind of grown up where I like um, I I never really thought about. I've never really thought about. I never. I never really saw myself with a girl of a specific color. I've. I've been out of white girls, mixed race girls, Indian, black. I think the only girl. The only girl um, race of person I haven't been out with is like Oriental, like Chinese or something. But that's not because I like you say. You say I don't think they like me. I just don't think. I don't know what it is. And but but then I don't really know many of them either. So I don't, for me, I um, I was always open if you're black or whatever race, but I'm just going to use black people as an example. If you're black and you're a black family of cousins or whatever, red, 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 whatever, and then you all got with someone of a different race, then that kind of, who's left as black? So I get this, but in my defense, I got Jalil though, so no one can't chat to me because <laughs> that still carries on. When you see a black girl with a white guy, does it make you feel away? Honestly. <laughs> so funnily enough, yeah, I, I was sitting there thinking about this like not that long ago. Yes, yes. is yes. the first, is, is the honest answer. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I don't but, really know why though. Because yeah. like, I don't feel the same way when I see a black man with a white woman. Yeah. Me, for me, blood, we we there's this is there's history. You know what I mean? There's there's 
you know what? I'm going to be honest, right? If I see a, a white guy with a black girl, I do look twice. I do look like... So... Huh? Like, I, I, I don't, it, don't, it don't make me feel angry or feel away. I'm just like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's but just I'm not, not, do you know what I mean? It's just not the norm. I'm not angry about it. I'm more... I'm more curious as to how this occurred. <laughs> but the same way it occurred with, with, with us. Because black girls... Black guys have been uh, going out with white girls from from early. Yeah, but I think a lot of that is it's just environment, like and yeah. um, what you're exposed to. If, if you're the one black in the village, blood, uh, what what are you supposed to do? Just not fucking, not not find love or not and not yeah. not procreate. None of them was that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. I, I understand. Well, and what if she's had bad? Do you know what? A lot, something, some things, is, is experience as well. Because that black girl might not have had good experiences with with this specific black guys that she's been with. Because it's not all black guys, just like it ain't whoever. But the ones that she's chosen. Because what this is what happens with people, isn't it? You choose. You hear girls say, oh, "I'm done with men," yeah, because of whatever. But it's not men, it's just the men that she's chosen. So she's put everyone in that category. So if a girl's been with, if a black girl's been out with three black guys or vice versa, a black guy, whatever, yeah, been out with three black girls and it doesn't work and then they find an Albanian, yeah, and then flipping, it works. Then it's cool, no? Answer, Rebecca. <laughs> we have Chelsea, yeah, from Essex. <laughs> Chelsea from Essex. Yeah. You meet, you're, you're on the train. You're coming home on the train, D, yeah? You got your, you got, you know what I mean? You're on the train. She's, you got, you're not looking, you're walking, and then she's walking, and you bump into each other like a movie now, yeah? Picture the scene now. <laughs> and you look at her, say sorry, because she spilled, you spilled something on her or whatever, like in the movie, and you get talking now. You're talking, and then like, this gal, Everything that you want in a gal, she's showing you this, yeah? But she's white, and her name's Chelsea, and she's from Essex. <laughs> her name's Chelsea, and she's from Essex. You're an idiot. Or you're not giving her a chance? Uh... Or are you going to let her, the fact that she's white, she's got everything, everything in a woman that you yet... Yeah, there's no woman you've met like this woman, yeah? And you've met her, but she's white. Yeah, I'm going to risk it for the biscuit still. I'm, I'm going to go back to the pool, bro. I'm going to go back to the pool. You, what, what? Hold on. You wouldn't? You wouldn't? Yeah, I'm going to bypass the something still. Yeah, you yeah, let yeah. go, D. Yeah, bro, yeah. Man, yeah he's standing on his... Okay, all right. What if she's, what if she's Indian? Be honest. I'm, yeah, I'm probably going to bypass this. Any part of Asia? Probably going to bypass this I'm still. What about half black? <sighs> Dwayne wants the full thing, you know. Dwayne is not... Dwayne is... Dwayne. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with the whole spectrum then. The whole, I mean, don't get me wrong, yeah? So you wouldn't, give, you wouldn't give a mixed race girl a chance? It's sweet of the juice. So in... In my experience, it, it's, it, it doesn't it doesn't go well. I'm not gonna lie. Mixed race girls are crazy though. I'm gonna just keep it real. Out of all the girls, I wasn't even trying to. <laughs> no, no, I'll say it. I'll, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. That's why I listen. And it, and the craziest girls yet. Yeah, when I say mixed race, it's mix of white and black. That them two mixes, <laughs> them two mixes of gal are crazy gal. The get all the mixed race girls out there, yeah. That's half black, half white. You know this as well. You lot know this. I'm not even, I'm not even a hype, yeah. I'm not even a hype because I don't discriminate. I don't discriminate. I'm just saying, yes, hundred percent. The craziest girls are mixed race girls. They're crazy. They're in, in nuts, blood. You get a half. Listen, I knew a girl that was half Jamaican, half Irish. <laughs> <laughs> So everyone out there knows, if you ain't black, 
You ain't got a chance. You ain't getting no ring on nothing from D. Yeah? You might get something else. You ain't, you ain't getting... You ain't getting no ring is what man's saying. Not, yeah, the message here is whether you're white, black, orange, purple, be with whoever you want to be. If you want to keep it, if you're white and you want to keep it white, keep it white. That's nothing wrong with that. But if other people ain't doing that, let just let people do their thing and you do your thing. And that's the message. That's all it is. Facts. Let right, people do But also, the message is if you're white, you ain't got a chance to break that. <laughs>